Why, hello there. Welcome back to Oxygen Not Included Spaced Out. This is uh, the Terrania base, the basic base. And we are about to finish our nighttime cycle, which is uh, about to be day. I'm your host, Get Good Fox. And yes, it's time for some more Oxygen Not Included. What are we going to be doing today? Well, I would like to do more things involving... Uh, what do you call it? Um, space. Thing though is that the space stuff requires quite a bit of metals. 800 kilograms of refined metal, which is not a small amount of kilograms. So I'm thinking that what we need to do is start focusing on this. Let's just start focusing on farming our technology. I'm just going to basically start, we're just going to start researching everything that Eve is related or something that I'd. Okay, DJ, you need to, like, chill out a little bit. Getting a little crazy there on me. What are these phosphorite balls doing here? Oh, these things are eating the phosphor. Oh, that's right. Yeah, they eat. I forgot. They actually eat mealwood. Uh, let's take a look at our food. Is food trending upwards or downwards? Yeah, yeah, that's great and all. Um, calorie con generation is... Appears to be trending downwards, which is interesting. Uh, I'm gonna keep an eye on it. Like 40k is kind of like you know, like we we can add another layer if necessary. Like I have other options, but in the meantime, I believe we will flip this off and go back to this. No germs. You guys better not be getting germs everywhere. It sure looks like you are. You know, you need to go over here and wash yourself off. Go over here and wash yourself off. This is due to all the slime that they are touching. Okay, so as you can see, the slime, the water is depleting downwards. That was part of the plan. That sounded important. New planetoids detected? Uh, star map. What is this? Sandy Orfield? Can, can Canopina? How interesting. That must be a place we can go to then. I believe that's exactly what it means. I mean, I don't know much besides that it seems to be some place we can go to, but... Wow, that is negative 84 degrees. That's rather cold. That is quite cold. Good gravy. All right, what do we got over here? Um, rocketry and operating? I don't know about that now. Researching and operating, uh, but you're a Luddite. A Luddite operator? I don't know about that now. I'll take... Wait, do we have a pip squeak? I don't think we have a pip. Pips are not native to this. Yeah, I'm going to take the pip. I kind of want the algae, but I'll take the pip. I don't think, I, I don't know if we have one or not. God, look at all these hatches there. That is a lot. Let's go ahead and, um, oh, one thing at a time. We need to puncture our way into here. And it looks like this is the ground level, so let's go ahead and continue what we're doing. And then we can punch through this. I mean, we're getting there. And then we can carve out some of these areas like this. And over here. And just allow all of the water to pool up in there. And then we'll have plenty of water. Very good. Yes, and we're gonna... I forget, do we... Let me check our priority. How many people know how to research? Okay, we have two researchers, so we don't need any more researchers than that. And now that I think about it, I think we want to prioritize... I'll make you a six. As much as I love the space stuff, I think this is more important. Yeah, let's get this going. Let's start researching this. This should be our priority. We need to start getting these technologies unlocked. Over here, we've got Sweepy is uh, on its way to do more work. Over here, you know, we're showing some signs of success. Progress is, you know, 
Not the fastest, but what can you do? Once they get down here, this will be the lowest area, and then we can kind of open this area up here. And that will allow all of the water to pool in. And this is, as you can see, I think you'll agree, this is not a small number. This is not a small number of um, polluted, not, not a small quantity of polluted water. Ah, it's all spilling in. Very nice. There we go. Plus, it'll drain the water out of here. We could mop up all this water, but, you know, for now, let's let's just not do that. Let's just let gravity do its work. Progress is not fast. But I guess it doesn't need to be. We could build another exosuit. What we really need is to begin refining metals. How close are you to giving me a... Okay, good. So now you are more likely to give me a smooth hatch than anything else. So the next time he lays an egg, he'll probably lay a smooth hatch egg. Pretty soon we'll need to disinfect everything, but I'm going to give them a chance. Basically, they're just going to keep polluting the area with more germs. And fortunately, I don't think the germs are they're very harmful. Not this particular kind of germ, at least. Over here, we can cut through that and let that drain out. All the water is just, like, draining out, which is good. Come on. You can do it. I have faith in you. We just got to cut through here and collect all of this stuff, and then we'll have a bunch of polluted water. And with all the polluted water, we can keep these plants growing. Ah, so this is filling up. That's That was the whole plan. The whole plan of this was to allow this to fill up, and that means all of the excess water will be diverted off. It's just taking a while to get to that point, which is fine. You know, it doesn't matter if it takes a while to get to that point. What did we research? Oh, Critter Sensor. I love Critter Sensor. Um, I need more refined metal, though. We're really getting, we're getting owned by our lack of refined metal, unfortunately. What I might even do is, uh, we might even build an incubator so that we can speed up the process of those. I should have been getting on those smooth hatches much sooner than we currently are. There it is, it's working. All of the excess, uh, all of the excess is now being diverted into here, which is perfect. There we go. Works like a charm. Do it, doing exactly what I wanted it to do. Now we'll never have to worry about the, uh, the system looping again. Or overflowing again, because all of the overflow just gets dumped right into there. And that gets pumped into here. Which, like, I don't know how much it matters. But the point is that it's working. It's happening. The system works. And I love to see a system work. I like, it's beautiful when the system works. Oh, it's taking so long. How's the research going? Is there, are we not researching anymore? Oh, well, we're done with the research, that's why. Uh, let's go ahead and just start getting all of these things involving um, the, the rockets. We're just going to get all of that done. <laughs> Look at all these hatches. Holy crap. There's so many of them. Also, let's turn this on. Egg. Get these eggs out of here. Clean them up. Yeah, get the eggs out of there. That's it. Okay. Now we can dump the eggs out. Someone mentioned that, you know, maybe we should use this uh, natural gas geyser. We could, but, like, we're not really hurting for electricity at the moment. Our electricity is doing fine. Like, the main reason we'd want to make that natural gas geyser is in the event we... We don't... We're not generating enough electricity, but that's not currently the issue. Like, we're generating plenty of electricity. Okay, we're almost there. Maybe we don't even need to do that part. 
that maybe that's perfectly fine the way it is. Like this water over here, we can do we can dig even more of that over time. I kind of want to just dig straight down and see what's down there, but Look at all this. Look at this thick layer of polluted oxygen. Slime lung report. It looks like there's a trace amounts of slime lung in the actual polluted oxygen. Not terribly surprising, but we're doing, seem to be doing a decent job of containing it. Oh my god, you built literally one tile! Let's get this whole thing disinfected. I know we'll have to redo it again, but... I mean, we're almost done. That's the important part. And then what we can do is just build a pump. And then we can start pumping this water in there. If it's not one thing, it's another, I guess. There we go. Clean it up. Oh, yeah. Oh, I see the germs are accumulating on the liquid vent. That's what's happening. How close are we to getting down here? Come on. Come on, guys. You can do it. Water is filling up pretty rapidly. Is there another mineral nearby that we could use that would be better? Sandstone. Nope, that seems to be all that's nearby. That's rather frustrating. Okay, so we just finished another research. Let's keep it going. So we just got um, advanced combustion. The sh sugar engine and the small solid oxidizer tank. Not sure what we're going to use that for. I don't need either of those yet. Um, man, these look like more space station stuff. Solar panels? Okay, um, sure. We'll, we'll get to that in a moment. What is this? The payload opener. What is this stuff? Virtual plane. What is this thing? Data. Let's try this. This thing seems interesting. Let's try that thing. I don't even know what that does. Oh, we do have pips. We have two of them. Are they talking to each other? I didn't even know if they were talking to each other or if they were just making noise. No, no, you don't need to do this anymore. Oh my god, please. Finish it. You can do it. You're so close to doing it. Okay, so we are going... Let's go ahead and make the piping. Now, I think what I'm going to do is just cut through one of the walls like this. Because, you know, we can pass the wall. We can get through the wall there. It's not that big of a deal. In fact, we only need to cut through this part here. And then what I can do is just add a vent there. And then same thing with the electricity. We should be able to just go like this. Boom. All right. What do we got here? Operating, ranching, and decorating. Interesting, but he's a snorer, so I'll take the briar seeds. I mean, we can deal with a snorer. Like, we have ways to deal with it. It's just I just don't feel like it. I feel like we can mop these up finally. Is there a reason why... We're not bottling water anymore? 
Maybe it's because they're they have to go there. I'm not sure why we're not bottling water, but we're apparently not doing that. Uh, I would like another switch so we can turn this off and on. Tapping into the natural resources. Oh my god, they're so slow. You're not even gonna make it. You're gonna go on break. Yeah, you're gonna go on break before you even do anything. I think what we need is another Atmo dock. Like a fourth person doing this would probably be a great idea. Oh, I can't do it. We need... <sighs> How much copper do we have? Let me just build like... Let me get like eight. Oh, there's a grown-up pip. Not as cute when they grow up as usual, but still kind of cute. Looks like they could be a Pokemon. Oh, he's like... He's taking the stuff out of the boxes. Don't do that. He's taking the things out of the boxes. Don't do that. I forgot that's what pips do. They take things out of boxes because they're annoying. I might need to, like, lock them away or something. Now I can't tame them, though, but I might lock them away somewhere. Somewhere where they can't get out. Here's what I'll do. Oops. I'll just put them right over here. Then they won't be able to do anything. How are we doing down here? Besides, like, really slow. Okay, looks like they cut through there, finally. Also, can we get a, um... Can we get a disinfection order going? Because I know you brought more of that slime lung in here. I know you did it. Okay, so we got more research done. So, uh, let's take a look at what some of these are. I'm just gonna continue going that way. I don't know what this is. More... Material science research? What does it do? Subatomic particles or something. I, I, I don't know what any of this does. Food. Okay, that's for the, the incubator. Could be useful. Have you laid me a hatch? Oh, there it is! A smooth hatchling egg. Yes. Okay. Um. Nothing. No, no, you're not going to feed anyone anything. Here, just, just, just destroy all of these. I don't care. We'll rebuild it, but you're not allowed in here anymore. And you're going to go over here. Where is my drop-off point? Did I move the drop-off point? Drop-off point's supposed to be right there. That's where, that's where we're going to put those other hatches. The reason we're destroying this is so that we can stop him from, like, eating up the rest of my copper. Because I don't want to turn copper into coal. There we go. And over here, we'll put the pips. So, um, critters, pip, and pip squeak. And now I can wrangle these fools so that they stop messing around. You too. And you know what? I'm going to put the Drekos over here as well. These interfearsome animals. Eating my crops and stuff. Yeah, I bet they're eating the crops. See, like, Drekos, they eat the crops directly off the vines. That's right. Get them out of here. Put them over here. Get them out of here. You can do it. So here's our smooth hatch egg, which is very nice. I want to actually get an incubator going so that we can incubate the smooth hatch as quickly as possible. That would be under food. Where's food at? Food. An incubator. Um, it doesn't really matter where we build it. I'll just build it right here. Okay, we researched another thing. Don't know what we did, but 
This is the big research episode, or we're beginning the big research. Um, I don't know what those are. Allows material research science to be accumulated, unlocking higher technology tiers. I really don't know what any of that does. I will be the first to admit it. Advanced gas flow. Gas canisters, containers, what are these? Large oxidizer tank, gases. I just don't know what any of this does. I feel like I should just hit the button and start researching them. I mean, why not? That's what I'm, in fact, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna hit the button on these things. Um, more research, sure, why not? What is this? The Radbolt generator refines radioactive ores to generate Radbolts? Emits generated Radbolts in the direction of your choosing? Uh, okay. The virtual planetarium conducts data analysis research to unlock new technologies, consumes data banks generated by exploration. Okay. Um, whatever you say, bub. Let's just put it somewhere, I guess. Let's put it right here, I guess. I have no idea what that does. I mean, I, have, I vaguely remember, I think it's that weird thing they get in and it's got like virtual reality BS going on. I have like a vague memory of it, but I don't remember it very well. No! You're supposed to stop him from eating our copper ore! Get him out of here! Do it now! Why is it taking- just get him! Get him and- get him out of there so he doesn't eat my copper ore. And then we can get this thing... Incubating. Why is it taking so long to wrangle them? It's so strange. Okay, let's put this at like an eight. Okay, here's the incubator nearly done. The incubator is used to like Hatch, well, I mean, I guess it makes sense. It's used to hatch the eggs faster. Orbital data collection lab. Material study terminal. Yeah, we're getting into a lot of the stuff that I'm not as familiar with. Or either that or I just haven't used them in a very, very long time. Hey, this is almost done. Look at this. They're doing pretty good. This guy's been tied up for the longest time. Okay, we can rebuild these here. And that's because uh, the smooth hatch is gonna go there. Why aren't we, Why I don't understand why we're not delivering these. I'm gonna make this a maximum priority. I want you to move this hatch over there, and I want you to do it now! Okay, here's the wrangling. Commence the wrangling. Now grab them. And put them over there. Why don't you want to do it? I chose the right hatch, right? Stone hatch, stone hatchling. Oh, I know what the problem is. Okay, never mind. I understand the problem. It's 20 creatures there. That's There's too many creatures there, I think. That could be the problem. Oh, there's 48 creatures there. That's strange. Um, so the problem is that it doesn't want to put them in this room. You know what? Murder. Kill. Destroy this fool. Okay, he's dead. We did it. Okay, the incubator is ready. This is gonna be a six, and we're gonna incubate Smooth Hatchling X. 
Okay, you are gonna be for... Only sm Okay, smooth hatches, we don't have them yet. So you're gonna be for metal ore, copper, and the rest of these aren't gonna work yet. Okay, so as you can see, this thing is now going to hatch a lot quicker. Is it gonna tell us? Oh, so incubation process is at 16%. It hatches once it hits 100%, and this is going to cause it to hatch way, way faster. It is rather hot, though. That's one of the problems with it. This thing is gonna generate a lot of heat. It's gonna be worth it, though, because like, like I said, we need to get the refinements under, you know, we need to get the refinements going. So what does this thing do? Oh, I see. So the research is for yellow. The yellow. What is the orange research? What is the yellow research? I don't have the faintest clue. Let's get the refinery. So if I understand this right, there must be another station that researches another... What does this do? The material study terminal conducts material to unlock new technology, but it consumes rad bolts. Okay. Orbital data collection creates data banks that can be consumed at virtual planetarium to unlock new technology. Consumes plastics and power. Active in space. Interesting. I feel like what we should be doing is probably unlocking all of the basic technology. All of the basic and advanced technology. That would be the, um, the basic technology is the research station and advanced technology is the supercomputer. That's probably what we should do. Radbolt generator, Radbolt reflector. Receives and redirects Radbolts from Radbolt generators. I don't know anything about that. How close are we to done with this? Oh, we're almost done. Make this a nine. Oh my god, we're so close to being done. Okay, and in the meantime, go ahead and mop all these up. Yeah, let's get this all cleaned up. Is it working? Why? Finish it. Please, please just build it. Please build it. You know you want to. You just want to build this one thing. Here we go. Oh, yes! Yes! Oh, we're finally doing it. Okay, let's see how our circuits are looking. Your part of that circuit, that's fine. Your part of this, this circuit has a lot connected to it. That's fine, though. How's this looking? Incubation is going very fast. 30, it's already doubled its incubation, which is great. Like I said, we just it just needs to happen. We have to get our metal refinement going. We're going to need uh, probably about three of them to get it going. Uh, you don't want too many of them. They can eat you out of house and home, really. They can. So I'm guessing that the reason why the radiation here isn't that bad, I'm guessing this um, abyssalite is pretty good at blocking the radiation. That would be my assumption, at least. Food does seem to be trending upward, so I guess we're fine on food. Oh, this is awesome. Okay, now we're basically feeding all of these. We can probably afford to build maybe two more of them. More research complete. I guess we got... Oh, yeah, this was the refinery. Hmm. I could probably do something with the refinery. The refinery gets really hot is the problem. Uh, let's just go ahead and keep researching. So what we should probably do... Let's just... I'm just going to start researching everything that doesn't have a yellow or an orange. I don't even care what it does. We're just going to unlock it. 42% looking great. Uh, let's see. Refinery. Uh, refinement. Uh, in order to make the refinery, we're probably going to want to make it out of the proper type of material. So let's go ahead and make it out of a, um... 
ceramic, I guess? I'm trying to find a place where we can build this. This, this thing gets really hot, is the, basically my concern. Um, it doesn't really matter. We're not going to build that much ceramic. We can just build it here. Actually, that's a stupid place to build it, because like they're just going to run out of oxygen. Like, basically, we need a hot place, like a place that we don't mind heating up or containing. But um, refinement, whatever, it doesn't matter. We're not going to make that much charcoal. It's going to get super hot. It's really not a good idea to put it here. I don't think I, I, mean, I can fix it with some ice. It's not that big of a deal. Okay, so here's the kiln. All right, so how much ceramic do we get? We get 100 kilograms of ceramic. So let's see how much we need. Metal refinery needs 800. Wow. Okay, we need to make a little more than I thought. We need about eight of these. Oh boy, it's gonna get hot. Hope you're ready for it to get hot. 20 kilo DTUs, it's gonna get hot. Really, really hot. Oh yeah, look at that thing heating up. Did we, did we make some ceramic already? Oh boy. Oh yeah, it's getting hot in here. And taking off all your clothes is not going to help. Here's the ceramic, okay. We're doing okay. So why do we want to make it out of ceramic? Well, ceramic is one of the most heat resistant materials for that are of the stone category. Because, you know, when you build things, you tend to either build it out of metal or you, you either build it out of metal or you build it out of um, uh, stone. And of all the, the stones, um, ceramic is very heat resistant. Let's actually take a look at uh, ceram... So we're up to 300 kilograms, which is nice. A juicer. Um, maybe in the future we'll have a use for it. Oh yeah, just stand right next to it. It's getting real. It's up to... This is a hit 93 degrees. This is getting hot. Oh yeah. Oh, I need to assign them a job. Well, you guys are kind of got everything going. Why aren't you dumping the water? That's the next thing I don't understand. Why aren't you going to deliver these suits? Why don't you want to sweep these up? Here, um... I'll let you guys pass. I want you to, like, dump this water right now. That's what that's your goal right now. Dump this water. Like, I'm okay with you dumping the water in here. You can do it. Is there a reason you won't pick up the water? Is like the water off limits? Am I, am I selecting the wrong thing? No, brine is correct. Water's collect. It's not on sweep only. So why won't you pick up the water? This game is rather mystifying at times. Why can't... So this is apparently blocked off. You can't make it there. Why not? Do you guys need to, like, sweep these suits up? Um, let me just make a, a, a storage for it. Put it right here. I'm not sure what the problem is. I'll be the first to... Like, sometimes I don't understand what the what is interfering with the duplicates. Oh, yeah, look at that ceramic. That ceramic is not... It, it is hot. Okay, let's get refinement... Let's just temporarily build a metal refinery somewhere. It doesn't matter where it's built. For now, we're just going to build it over here. How much electricity do you use, by the way? Would you mind telling me how much electricity you use? Oh, 1.2 kilowatts. Yeah, we can't even use that right now. 1.2 kilowatts, that would need a... Um, that would need, like, the heavy-duty wires. Oh, this area is heating up because of the water. Remember, the water we're pumping in it is really, really warm. How close is this to being done? 81% getting there. 
It's not too bad. So this is rapidly cooling down because the air temperature is so cool. That's one thing that's nice is that if it's cold, then it's kind of hard to heat up, but it, it, it basically it just kind of resists temperature. Okay. Can I get another disinfection order? Are we, are we not researching anymore? We're supposed to be researching. And we need to go right down the list. Doesn't matter if I have any plan to use it or not. Let's just get the research done. The, I would like to... I'm trying to push... Oh, it's done. It's done? Is it ready? Is it ready to hatch? Oh, it's almost ready. Wait, why isn't it hatching? Oh, incubate, 89%. There it is. I was clicking the wrong thing. There's so many of them. Good gravy. Oh, man, it's crazy. Um, Brian, 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 I just want to see. Why aren't they dumping the brine in? I said, don't, I want you to dump the brine in. Are you going to do it? Why do you dump this brine in? But you won't dump that one. It must have something to do with the suits. Uh, miscellaneous. No. Clothing. All of the clothing. Make this a high priority. This needs to be an eight. I want you to get all of that there, and then you can, like, deliver it when you're done. How did you get out? Capture that fool. Ninety-four percent, which means we're almost there. Also, we can do this. We can also turn this back on. Make that a six. Nice. Okay, how are we doing on um, fiber? Not fuber, fiber. We've got 20 units of fiber. Okay, we're doing okay. This is, oh, we, we get to see it. We're gonna get to see it. We're gonna get to see it. It's any moment now. It's gonna hatch at any moment. Oh, we also need to research. Hold on a second. Let's get a research. Oh no no, they're 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 good. They're good. It's gonna hatch. Come on, 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 come on. At any moment, we're gonna have a smooth. Oh oh, there it is. Look at that. Look at that. That's a smooth hatch. Oh, he's kind of cute actually. Look, he's got a smile on his face. He's like he's happy. Oh, we need to put the we need to designate an area for the smooth hatch now. Here we go. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. You get to go over here, priority eight. Yeah, these should be high. Priority eight. No, sevens. Here he is! Oh, he just ate and pooped some copper right off the bat. Okay, here we go. Um, smooth hatch. Copper, smooth hatchling, copper, copy. There we go. All right, so what this guy does, let me see if we can see his definition. Smooth, he's not gonna look, once he grows up, he's not gonna look quite as cute, but smooth hatch um, eats copper, gold, iron, wolframite, aluminum, all kinds of stuff. Uh, it doesn't have any other definition on him, I see. Interesting. Anyways, the point is that the, the hatch eats metal ore, and he, instead of pooping out coal like all of the other hatches, this particular hatch poops out refined metal. So that's going to be one of our ways. Uh, we got to make sure that we do it correctly, though. We only want to have, like, three, maybe four. four. Even four might be too many. Okay, let's keep researching. Right here. 
Okay, so in, what I was saying earlier is the only way we're going to actually be able to get... Oh, we don't even have it researched yet. We would need to get the heavy-duty wires, not the heavy-watt wires. The heavy-watt wires are for the power plant, which... Um, we might have to start thinking about building the power plant. I kind of didn't want to do that because the power plant is kind of a pain to build. Nice. These are all growing really nicely. Oh yeah, this area is getting really hot. We'll have to start cooling it down with um, some ice later on, but for now that's good enough. So this, this little guy over here is going to be... He's not going to be, what do you call it, um... He's going to be a little baby for a while, so, you know, we're still kind of getting there. It's like, you know, this isn't exactly a fast process, I'd like to point out. Let's check our supplies. Coal. We've got 84 tons of coal. Let's check algae. We've got 34 tons of, or 38 tons of algae. Doing okay in that regard. Anyways, that is going to be the end of today's episode. Things are going, like, um... We're a little bit behind schedule on certain things. Like we're mainly are we're mainly weak on refined metals. Like that's like a really big problem right now. Is our refined metals could be a lot better. But at the same time, you know, we're we're still doing pretty okay. Like overall, it's not it, it could be way worse than it actually is. Like we're just bought like I said, we're just behind schedule on certain things. In fact, what if I just do more of these? Anyways, let me know what you think down in the comment section. Like the video if it was entertaining. Subscribe for future Oxygen Not Included spaced out content. And of course, remember that you don't have to be good to get good.